What's up everybody? My name is Anthony Streams and tonight we're going to be finishing Stray. So two weeks ago we did end off uh, getting the transceiver up here to the antenna. Today we're going to put it in. We're going to find out what happens. I have no idea what happens. Um, sorry about the week break also. While, while we're at it I had some things that I had to take care of. So we're a week behind but this here is the finale. So let's get this transceiver put into this antenna and let's see where things go from here. Ooh, I'm nervous. We are, we are getting boxes. Okay, what, what is it? <laughs> What's happening? I think we restored. Look, the view is beautiful from here. I remember now, the city, it was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only lights marketing or marking the her medic roof sealing off the city. So, so they're under the city. Those lights are from a roof. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside. But it came at a cost, nobody can go out. What's on the outside? The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. But if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. That's weird. What could it have been? My promise wasn't to go to the outside. It was to open the city. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. Awesome. Okay, so that is a roof. We are sealed in here. The humans made that to protect us from something on the outside. But we just came from the outside. I don't know. I don't know, guys. How cute. The Slums Part 2. Okay, let's go talk to Momo. He's not here? This is a mo- Oh, ooh, a note from Momo. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar. Or I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of, of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is? Alright, what is what is simple about that? Can we get a B12 to memorize that, please? 
Be careful, it is case sensitive. See you at the bar, Momo. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. Wait, are they really going to expect me to memorize it? Maybe I should write it down just in case. That was a lot. I Surely not, right? I don't know. I feel like to be safe, maybe we should go ahead and write it down. B12 doesn't remember it. Oh, okay, it's got it. <laughs> I thought we were gonna. I'm so glad I didn't write that down. I would have been so irritated. Okay, let's go find Momo at the bar. We kind of also need to figure out who needs this blanket. Did all the robots go somewhere? The guy that was laying there is gone. Okay, no, there's still some robots around. None of them are on the roofs, though. Okay, he's still sitting there. Um, okay, so some people moved around. There's Momo. Hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. We still need to know what happened to the humans. Let's sit up here. Oh, can we not get on the stool? There we go. How cute. Let me see if I can get this thing working. I've almost got it. Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes we can hear you. We are from the slums. We are looking for a way out. And? Wait, is that you, Baltazar? Momo? I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Baltazar. Where are you? Are the others okay? So Baltazar is outside? We are safe. We found a way up. Oh, that's so exciting. Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. The sewers. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Ooh. Darn it, we've lost the signal. I can't believe Baltazar is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums. But if Baltazar made it, there must be a way. Name Samus? We'll never get past the sewers. It's infested with Zerks. I, I love how, like, we'll never get past the sewers, even though, like, Baltazar's already done it. We'll make a quick meal of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Actually, I'm the only person here who has gotten past the Zerks a couple times, so you can put a little more respect on Lulu's name. Anyway, I warned you, your business is none of my business. Okay, rude. Everybody in this game is so negative. 
His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. Ooh, we know about Doc. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Samus has never been the same since. Maybe he's still alive. Don't listen to Samus. He's just scared, like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Samus' apartment. Come on, follow me. Oh my gosh, I love just having somebody that we can walk around with. We still haven't figured out who to give that to, that poncho. And it's not that person. Still not you, huh? <laughs> that robot is still so mad about the pain. I feel him though. Wait, would this person need it? They're digging in the trash. Did they just... That was weird. Okay. I don't know if that was a glitch or... You know your father would have wanted us to help. Or wanted to help us. There we go. Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on saying this. He doesn't want to hear about the Outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you? I think I have an idea. You want me to break into his house, don't you? Yes, you do. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Samus. I mean, we're kind of breaking and entering here. Contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to reestablish communication with the others. This feels so wrong. <laughs> what are you doing in here? I told you. Getting through the sewer is suicide mission. Leave me be. Do, do you want the poncho? <laughs> no, he still says the same thing, no matter how irritated. <laughs> okay, let's get him let's give him the book. Was this wait, is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our f flat. In our flat, but where? A secret lab right under my nose. Maybe there's a clue hidden somewhere around here. Okay, so let's go look for the clue then. Well, that was quick. <laughs> Time will tell. Sounds like maybe we should mess with the clock. Mm -hmm. 
Is that some kind of clue? Yeah, it means one of your clocks. Never noticed that DigiCo before. How did I miss it? I have no idea what the password could be. Well, we're going to find out because it's going to be behind the clock! Can we not jump up there? Okay, let's get the clock situation. How do we get to them? That's weird. Tom can tell is telling me that this is going to be something related to those clocks. I don't see anything that we've missed so far. You need to help me out here, Sam. You can just do something. <laughs> just can you remember anything? Um. Okay, there's cl clearly something we're missing. It's the way we came in here. Is this it? Nine nine. What is that? I wish I could read that. I wonder if that has anything to do with anything. Huh, let me see if I can... Okay, so we need to find a four-digit number somewhere. Oh! Duh, the four clocks. That says two o'clock, that says five o'clock, that says one o'clock. One o'clock. So two, five, one, one. I knew it. I knew it! I'm so good. I 
Observations. Cute sounds, but never friendly. Old bacteria of human time. Eat and kills of materials. Eats all kinds of materials, excuse me. Eat all kinds of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to intense light. Never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints. They must be for the Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and he never came back. Yeah, those Zerks is what he's describing right there. Is this a Zerk in the... I think it is. That's uh, quite disturbing, Doc. Zerk are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal. So the Zerk became very dangerous to the robots. Did you find anything interesting in here? No, we did not yet. Okay, so we need to be looking. We need to be on our detective work. If I were a betting man, I would bet that that's uh, something come came out of there that we needed. Or maybe it didn't. See, don't know what that says because it's all the way in the corner. What if we did it? There we go. Secret lab. Do all scientists have a secret lab? The Zerk weapon should be around here. Okay, so we want to look on, look for either the weapon itself or information. It must be this because they're taking forever to push it over. Yep, which means something uh, a little heavy would have been in it. Okay, let's continue looking real quick. Okay, this is the defluxer blueprint. The concept, light-based handgun, low priority, visual appearance, size, decibel emitted, high priority, test in real condition, objective 20 Zerk destroyer per second. Ooh, that's a lot of Zerks. Whoops. Okay, let's show him the broken tracker. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find where he went. I can't believe my Papa might still be alive. I've missed him so much. Well, that's sad. Let's not get your hopes up, though. He's probably dead. You need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My Papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair that tracker so that we can find him. Someone in the slum should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. Let's do it. I mean, it's... Are you gonna... 
You gotta fix that tracker. You're resourceful. Maybe you can find someone in slums. Oh, so you're not. Oh, okay. You're not actually taking me to somebody. Okay, so we need to find somebody who needs a blanket, and we need to find somebody that can help us. Oh, reverse his tracker. I don't remember if we met anybody. What is that? talk to Elliot for things like this. He's a little wizard with electronics. He lives just over there. Thank you. Well, that helped a lot, actually. But I want to see if we can figure out what that noise was. That is really weird. I can't figure out. Maybe it's... It must be from up. Okay, she said he lives right over here. That's Guap and Corey. Elliot program. Yeah, okay, Elliot's in here. Knock on the door and wait for us to open. Let's do it! I don't think he's the one that needs the blanket, but we haven't been up here in a while, so... Nope, it's not him either. Okay, well... Nobody needs your damn blanket, Grandma. Where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. Wait, Elliot wanted the blanket? Really? Thanks for the poncho. Come see me if you ever need anything fixed. That's probably what he would have asked. So if we didn't find the poncho, he probably wouldn't have done the tracker thing until we got the poncho. So we probably got that early. That's what I'm assuming. I do have something I need fixed. Funny how that worked out, didn't it? I should see how you get things in life. You just show up and kind of give them a little something. That's great. That's a great tracker. I recognize this model. It's a Tohima. Tahuma? Tohima? BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? Yeah, actually, that's what we needed it for. Let me just take a look. You got to give it an update. And one more thing. Voyolia. That's not what that says. <laughs> I completely made that up. And it's fine. 
Uh, fix tracker, gain new item. There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you were looking for. Well, thank you, buddy. I'm just gonna jump out your window here, I hope you don't mind. Just a cat doing cat things. Um... Maybe we go back to the bar and see what Momo has for us? I'm really struggling to get a connection back. Did you find anything interesting? Sorry, don't know how to use that. Okay, so... There's nothing. Let's, let's go find Elliot then. Well, we know where he where he lives. The question is, do I remember how to get there? Fixed it. Well done. Give it here. I hope I got a good screenshot before that went off. We got a ping. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it. I feel like you're really getting your hopes up, Samus. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my Papa went. Okay, well, I'm not exactly ready yet because I kind of want to finish uh, looking around in your house. See if there's anything in here that I need. I feel like we did a good job searching in here. Never be too safe. Okay. I'm pretty confident then. Let's see where he went. We have nothing in our items, right? We are doing really good with our items. Getting everything where they need to be. This is exciting. This is it. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure I need to know. Let's do this. I agree. This is exciting. Let me guess he's not going to come with us. Oh, he is. Oh, this makes you such a savage. Oh, 
Look at all these Zerk eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. Don't be scared. I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He will know that you're a friend. Your papa made it. You can make it. Quit being a little bitch and come on. I'll open the door for you. Oh, what a wuss. Alright, here we go. Where are Zerks? We need to be ready to run at any moment because they will be coming. Look at how huge this wall is. I remember, it was a symbol of the division between those in the slums and in Midtown. Then the fact that they kept throwing their garbage down here. What a horrible thing to do. Maybe that's why they failed. The Midtown, okay. Dead end. That doesn't sound good. This has to be. Yep, there's Zerk. Ooh! I feel like the running back. <laughs> Trying to avoid all the defensive players on the other team. Oh! How were you supposed to get around that? There you go. There you go. Come on, Lulu. Stay under that. There you go. There you go. What's the goal from here? This is not a way to go. We need to go down the middle. <laughs> oh my god. We're at, No, I wouldn't run right into the... Okay, that's a jump. Jump. Are we good? I like where we're at. Stop for a second. Eh, what a bunch of losers. Okay. That was fun. I'm just really glad we don't have to run from Zerk up here. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have more Zerk coming up. Oh, sick. I like this. Oh my god, that is bad. Okay. <laughs> that was so cool. That was the greatest. That was a huge fall. B12, you know what? High five, buddy. That was insane. 
Doc should be nearby. We must be close. That was so cool. Can we just talk about how cool that was? Lulu, you're a badass. Just so that you know. Okay, I don't know how confident I feel here about the Zerk. Okay, that would be where we need to jump. But y'all know we have to check our surrounding areas. Is this a translate situation right here? Okay, I don't see anything Zerk related. Maybe we're okay from the Zerg. There's a basketball. It looks like maybe there's some human activity going on here. I'm assuming this is where Doc is. Oh, I don't know that if Doc has been out here, it's a lot of bacteria. That could be his building right there. Okay, let's see what we can find up here. Oh, so far I'm not running into anything that you can even interact with. closed I mean I would assume following that wire would get us where we need to go but this looks like way too much going on over here not to check out Ugh, the Zerk are so disgusting. <laughs> um, okay, let's follow this wire. There's an open window. Okay, yeah, this has to be Doc. He's got damn Zerk in a cage. It 
It would be too easy for him to be here, though. He's not here. You're not a Zerk. Who are you? That's my badge you're wearing. How did you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, same as you clever boy. I never did get how they thought the cat was a Zerk. They look absolutely nothing alike. I've been alone here for ages. I came here to test my deck def defluxer. There we go. But it didn't go as planned. I wish I could go back home. I miss my son dearly. You can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. Well, how about you just follow me and we can just walk back. It really wasn't that big of a deal. Stucky Zerks will attack as soon as we step outside. Okay. Alright, calm down just a little bit. What do we have? Remember? I've seen humans wear costumes like this. They were small and running around making a lot of noise. Yeah, we're kind of weird. Yes, I remember now. They were children. Right! The kids! The streets felt much more alive with the idol. Or with the, excuse me, <laughs> even with the difficult, even with the difficulty they brought, these adults seemed to love them very much. Doc says he misses Samus. Is that the same thing? It kind of is. And yes, kids are fucking annoying. Um. Ooh, excuse me. Anything of importance? Looks like we need to find a... I'm going to assume we need to find like a cassette. Hey, be careful with that defluxer. At full charge, it can explode zerks like confetti. Wait, why are you stuck here? This baby needs 1.21 gigawatts to work, and the only thing around here with that kind of juice is the generator outside the house. Okay, well I guess that makes sense. Problem is that it won't start. I think a fuse blew, and with all the zerks around, it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix it. Okay, I'm glad they answered that, because I was like, you've been sitting here with this defluxer the entire time? I'm not fast enough, but you might be. If you can reach the generator and replace the fuse, I should be able to get the defluxer recharge. Come on, follow me. I'll show you what to do. Alright. Alright. Ooh, excuse me, excuse me. Here, take this fuse, it's brand new. 
Turning on the generator will be loud, so expect some zerks. Once you fix the generator, I should be able to charge the kickstart. Uh, be able to charge and kickstart the defluxer. You just need to follow this cable. Change the fuse, then meet me back here. Best of luck. Yeah, I'm glad that cable's there. It does make this so much easier. Okay, so once we get that fuse going, we're going to have to deal with these zerks. Shouldn't be too hard. Okay, we need to be ready to run. Here they come. Oh, nice. That's exactly what we need. Oh, buddy! Maybe I try staying in the light? Okay, so maybe we'll try to stay in the... Stay in the purple, right? Is that what they want us to do? Okay, that was pretty cool. <laughs> he is super excited. Go ahead, Doc. Amazing, you got the generator back on. Have you seen how powerful the defluxer is? It's definitely our way out of here. Wait a minute, I might be able to mount this defluxer to your drone. Ooh, please do. That's a big defluxer. You gonna be able to fly around with that? The defluxer is now installed on your fancy drone there. It's not meant to run off such a small power source. If you use it too much, it could malfunction. Just remember it's dangerous. Now let's go back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Yeah, but I'm not quite ready to go yet. This definitely has to be more... Oh, I feel like we looked at everything. I still think that's really weird. What is this, just to scratch the wall? Okay, maybe nothing? All right, let's go, Doc. I mean, you never told me how to use it. Take out all those zerks so we can get through. Hold L1. Okay, so it's got that little bar. We got to make sure that we. It, that we don't uh, go too high on so it doesn't malfunction. It's working great, but as I suspected, it can overheat. Let it cool for a bit. When that happens, I'll... Yeah, we figured all that out, Doc. You're a little late. You're not the only genius here.
Why didn't you bring... Hmm. It would have been nice if we would have made two of these. The switch doesn't work. It looks like the electricity has been cut. Why would it have been cut? There must be a way to open that door. Okay, well... Okay, don't have anything new to add. Uh... Okay, maybe we need to go up that pipe. Music sounds like it's about to be Zerk City. Oh, it overheated. Okay, uh, that sucked. <laughs> that sucked. Okay, we're not gonna forget this time. I think killing Zerks is becoming one of my favorite things to do right now. <laughs> oh, that's... Oh my god. I didn't know what we were up against there. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. tough. overheating sucks 
No, it is a good mechanic. Once we get docked there, I think that we're uh, doing pretty good. Don't be scared. Nice! He gets to see his dad! Oh, what a moment. That's so cool. This game is so good. It took a while for it to get to get going, but once it starts, once the game starts going, once it starts getting really good, it is really good. Thanks for saving Doc. Little friend, it's great to see that Samus is no longer alone. Now we know that we can fight back against the Zerks. Momo has been waiting for you by the sewers. Awesome! Dog and Samus look happy. I think we did a good thing together. We did, B12. We actually did really good. Do you have tin cans? You owe me. Wait, why do I owe you? This is really impressive, Doc. Nobody has survived that long in the dead city. Yeah, I know where the shit. Yeah, sure, I'm so happy he's back. Okay, what does Doc say? Hi, Teddy. What's up, Rosie? Oh, Billy. Do you know my son, Samus? It's thanks to him that I came back from that damn place. Alright, alright. Well, it's thanks, thanks to me, but... Look at all this great stuff that falls into our trash. So many treasures. You should go visit the Barter Man. There's something for everyone over there. Barter Man, huh? You're new around here, what can I do for you? Oh, oh, I guess nothing. Who is the barter man? Is that the guy up the stairs? This is a newspaper from the people living above on level two. It's a few years old, but it's something to read. You're not the barter man. This door is locked. Oh, Barterman should be over here. That's weird.
Is this really not him? Let's go see what Momo wants. Water main is this way. Okay, yeah, let's go talk to Momo. We'll we'll get there. Momo is waiting for you on his boat. You can join him, but have you done everything you wanted in here? Because I'll close the door behind you. Don't want any Zerks coming through. Yeah, we don't have anything, uh... I don't have anything in here. Okay, yeah, let's go down here and let's go see Momo on his boat. Okay, let's see if we can find Momo. There he is. This is so exciting, we might finally be leaving the slums. John, no, I can't get on the boat just yet. I gotta see if we left anything. No, I don't. It feels like there wouldn't be anything to leave behind here, because I don't think we can go back. Can't believe you found Doc and got the defluxer. With this, now we can go find Baltazar. Well, let's go. I like it. I like it, I like it. The sewers. <laughs> it's too cute. Let's get one more. Wish we can get it without that little circle there. This place is creepy. Yes, Momo, I agree. We want to get out of get out of these. If we want to get to these other folks, we need to go through the sewers. Times like these, I'm happy I have no sense of smell. Ooh, very true. We're lucky to be a robot. It's dark, creepy, and smelly, just like a sewer. I should have seen what I was supposed to do first. Okay, you have nothing to add. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Let's talk to uh, Momo. I don't see any way to open this gate. Can you take a look on the other side? I sure can, but how do I get there? Easy peasy. I have a bad feeling about that over there. 
like that's like gonna hatch into uh, Zerks. There's no way it's gonna be this easy. That's definitely gonna be Zerks. <laughs> uh. Yep. I was right. Okay, let's let that charge first. I overloaded it. That's not good. been this far out of the slums with with you here I'm not even scared oh look at you we will make a man out of you Momo a man Lemon. over here. We need to get that open. Don't look like we need anything on this side of the of the area. I think that's just stuff that's there. Okay, so we're only going to be working on this side. Makes life a little easier. Okay, yeah, nothing new. This old machinery is broke. Oh, all right. Yeah, blame it on the machinery. Uh, I think we can only open it manually. Which means I'm going to have to do it, huh? Is that what you're telling me? Or am I going to have to fight off Zerk? We have to fight off Zerks while he does that. That's what's going to happen. Jump below the door, it won't hold for long. Jump below the door? I can't go on with you, but I won't stop looking for a way. When you find Baltazar and Clementine, tell them I was brave. You're not gonna die. You'll be alright. Uh, but I might. This is sick. Oh no. Um, let's hope that's not Clementine or Baltazar.
this game is getting so much better as time goes on. I'm really enjoying this. Um, there's way too many of these to try to fight. Wait, what is happening? I don't know where I'm at. Okay, this isn't where we want to go. It is really hard. It is really hard to see that we may have to kill everything. Oh, is there a reason they put me right here? Wait, this had to have been the right way. I don't think I'm going backwards. It looks like it though. I'm a thousand percent going backwards. It's not through here. If we don't get too close. Oh, that's not good. Okay, here's a door. So are we looking for some kind of switch for this possibly? Why was I not prepared for that? Okay, so at least we know where we're going. Where we go? Oh, okay, I see where the ramp's at. Third time's the charm. I didn't know where the jump was going to be. I just knew we were, <laughs> we were coming to a ledge. And I was like, yo, just press X when you get there. It's got to be somewhere. Oh, wow. This game is so cool.
Oh, is that like eyelids? I'm so uncomfortable right now. We want to get to those other folks, we need to go through the sewers. Oh, okay, you have nothing new to add. I don't like that. Why am I scared? I should not be scared playing Shuri. Those eyes open. Oh no. This is super unsettling right now. Can we jump to that. So we gotta go back around. Oh no. What's wrong with this? wonder what these eyes do. Oh, it wakes them up. I was pressing the wrong button to run. Yeah, I'm stuck. It takes B12 to get that out. Maybe we get. I really feel like we're better off trying to kill them. The eye situation is sick. Uh, there's more coming from somewhere. There they go. Film eyes are creepy. Oh my god, I'm so glad we're done with that. I would prefer to never see them again. Oh! Fuck! <laughs> yeah, we're not gonna be done with them anytime soon, are we? B12 is like, fuck this. B12, don't get too close. Well, you better still be alive. We're back to this, trying to outrun these stupid things. 
Ah! I'm, my controller's not even... My controller's not even the issue anymore. They're still hard to outrun. Zergs are so annoying. Go the other way, go the other way. Oh, nice, hurry up, hurry up. Let that door close. We got it. Come on, B12, we need you to, we need you to kick. We need to kick back up, man. Don't do this. Oh my god, this is so sad. Oh! Okay. This could have been... Oh my god, this could have been a heartbreaker. Uh, it was dark. I was alone. It felt like I was back in the network. Oh, B12. But you saved me. Thank you, friend. B12, we love you. Drawing that much power was rough on my core. The deflex is completely destroyed. We'll have to be careful. Yeah, well, thanks a lot for fucking it up. And we have a robot. Is this Baltazar? Baladin? Baladin? A traveler from the sewers. We haven't seen one of you in ages. Are you the one who contacted us earlier? The little outsider? Baltazar the Outsider has been expecting you. He's meditating at the top of our village. Is this what he's been doing? Is meditating? Do you have anything else for us? Yeah, okay. yeah you have nothing. Alright, alright. Just double checking. The Ant Village. They got the whole little setup going. This machine, the scientist I assisted used one of these. What is that? He was sick. This was his last hope. He walked into the machine. Time machine? But I wasn't with him. He was alone. What was he doing? He uploaded himself into the computer and then everything was different. But the upload, some. But the upload, something went wrong. He was stuck for hundreds of years. Until a little cat appeared. Am I the little cat? Was it... It was me. I was the scientist. Wait, did the people turn into robots? I was human. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. I need a moment. Yeah, well, so do I, B12, because you just fucked my whole life up right now. My whole head is fucked. What is happening? You were a human. So everybody here was human. That's what happened to the humans.
I'm sorry. I... I need a second. I need a moment. I don't feel like talking right now. Alright, well... I wasn't trying to talk to you. Can I not talk to him? Can we not talk to anyone? Oh, I mean, what better time than uh, to be a cat, you know, since we can't talk to anybody. God, this is like screenshot central right now. Okay, so we can't talk to any of them since he's not in a talking mood. Oh, this all just scratch the scratch the couch, okay. What else have I forgotten? I must have had parents, friends, what happened to everyone? I wanted to open the city, but is there even anyone left to save? I don't know, I don't know what happened. Can't go up any more steps. Okay, well, I mean, I kind of need to know what I need to be doing, so... Oh, we'll go up here. Here we are! Let's see if we can get some questions answered. What is this? That's code. Hey, don't you know not to interrupt a fellow during transcendental transcendental meditation? Oh, it's you. You were with Momo when we received that call earlier. I'm glad to meet you at last, little outsider. You know Momo and Doc, so you're already familiar with us outsiders. I miss them. Their memory brings me peace. Momo stayed in the slums. I heard you helped find Doc and Clementine. She's in Midtown now. If you still want to see the outside, she's the one who can get you there. Apparently she had some kind of plan to leave the city. Here, take this. I wrote her address on the back of this picture. Oh, it's cute. To reach Midtown, climb up our little village. It should be easy for a dexterous one like you. If you manage to reach the outside, you will be the very first. I'd wish you good luck, but you don't need it. I believe in you. Finally, somebody that's not so negative. I'm sorry for shutting down earlier. I'm human, probably the last in the world. Now, look what's left of me. So much has came back to me. How much have I forgotten? Maybe if we find Clementine, we can restore my memories and get you back home at the same time. 
we can go back down and find out more from companions or head onward to Midtown. Oh, we're definitely gonna go talk to people. Did Bonifar have anything else? You should go find Clementine. I hope nothing has happened to her. Climb to the top of our belly to find her. I know, you tell me. Wait, do we have anything to show him? I don't remember if we have anything. No, we just have the picture. Okay. Bye! Wait, is this the way to Midtown? Yes, I think it is. Well, we're gonna go back down because we got people we, we need to talk to. Starting with you. A soothing sound of trash falling, shimmering waterfalls, no dangers. It's a blissful place to work on my poetry here. Listen. The mighty concrete shielding me in its womb. Shall you also be my tomb? You think it's too solemn? I think you're, you're a little weird. Alright, I'm going to um, head down here. What's up with this guy? Electric zerk everywhere. You have nothing to offer? Wasn't there somebody this way? Oh, hello there. It has been so long since we had a visitor. Well, except those damn Zergs, of course. Imagine if we could harness their power. Having them run in a wheel or something, such wasted potential. When I grow up, I want to be great, like Aunt Clementine. I want to explore like she did. But the grown-ups forbade us to leave the Ant Village. Oh, I mean, Billy, you probably shouldn't leave here. I think they did right by you. Nine thousand five hundred thirty-six games, one to six. Whoa, ooh, damn! <laughs> Don't tell anybody I'm actually programmed to win at this game. Uh. Uh-oh. Sorry. Oh, he's not happy. They're, they're not happy. Look, buddy, he was programmed to win, so it wouldn't have it wouldn't have went well for you either way this went. Alright, well I'll let y'all pick that up. Damn, I tried to knock some more off. Did you know there are more than nine hundred shades of white paint? I don't tell anyone, but I'm creating my own shade of paint. I'm calling it Garbage Brown. That's, uh... Interesting, to say the least. May is in her disconstructivist period, so she says. I'm sure she'll become a great artist. If only she could practice elsewhere. I do love the smell of fresh paint. It reminds me of... Oh wait. I can't smell anything. How sad. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> the sad face. That's alright. Y'all still don't want to talk to me? Alright, they're pretty pissed. Okay, so we came down here, we talked to people, we got some okay conversation. Oh wait, we got something we can remember. I could imagine there's so much I miss with the remembrance part. This language, the companion robots made it from scratch. How impressive. I remember it happening when I was in the network. I don't know when exactly, but at one time, all the communication started to switch to these symbols. I was stuck in a computer and alone for a long time. So I translated every symbol and word one by one until I was able to understand everything. Now that I'm out and I know their language, I'm curious to hear all they have to say. Well, as you can see, B12, they didn't have much of shit to say. What? Alright, Lulu, what are we doing?
There we go. Okay, so we've talked to everybody. You can jump to this side if there's nothing here. Well, that would have to be the way to go, wouldn't it? No, right here. How are you? Did you know that Aunt Clementine taught us how to grow special plants that can live without sunlight? I have a huge collection of them. Do you want to see? It's still missing some colors though. I'm missing a yellow plant, a red one, and yes, a purple plant. If only someone small and agile could get them for me. We can get you a purple plant, actually. Now we gotta walk all the way back down here. I didn't see a yellow or a red plant. Just him. Does he have any new conversation? No. Okay. Same thing. We found him. Um. She needs yellow and red now, I believe. How would we get there? There's definitely a way there. It still doesn't lead to anything. It just feels off to me. someone could snatch a yellow plant, a red plant, and a purple plant. I got the purple. Oh, I heard it's a rare plant. Thank you. You actually have a lot over there. Could you find another one for me? Please, please. You have quite a bit of flowers over there. Can't be that rare. 
I'm bored. Oh, Clementine used to hold classes here. We learned a lot of cool stuff. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> to be honest with you. Uh, Y'all are hyping this Clementine up. I'll see for myself if I think she's legit. Dav. Okay. Hold on. What does the bucket go to? People call me the Tin Chef. I specialize in upcycling leftovers. Today's special ramen J45 with my secret ingredient. Okay. The food is actually horrible, but it's all the <laughs> thing around. I'll have to unscrew my front casing if I keep eating this trash. Damn. Okay. Oh, we're on the other side of Baltazar. Man, all there's so many ways to go right now. Where where is this leading to? Where are we? Oh, okay, we're back right here. I see you. Another great photo moment. Oh my god, I wish we could move the camera around. So awesome. Alright, stop, stop, stop. Thank you. We're even further away from the red plants. Hmm, there's your little plant. Okay, all we need is the red. We'll go ahead and give her the yellow since we're right here. If you don't want to help me, it's okay, but I was taught to help others. Just I am... Malo, Malo, whatever it is, you're fucking pushing it. I love that color. Thanks, buddy. Can you find the other for me? Please, please. You are... You're a pain in the ass. If I'm just being honest with you. She'll work on your people skills. Thank 
feel like we're getting further and further from the red plant. Oh, I didn't mean to go in there. Can we turn back around? I may have just fucked up. Yep. <laughs> we just fucked up. Okay. Well, you know what? Milo, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, yeah, dumbass, that doesn't go there. Okay, so we gotta find what does. It would be so nice if there's no Zerk situation going on here. Look at the subway station. I had completely forgotten this kind of transportation existed. You could ride to anywhere in the city and people used to take it to go to work. I used to take it too. Every morning I had to say goodbye to my family at home. I remember I was doing this for them, but they're gone now. It was so long ago. They wanted to see, uh, they wanted to see the outside. But does that even matter anymore? What happened to them? What happened to everyone? Anywhere near Midtown, let's find this Clementine. Oh, anyway, we're near Midtown, let's find this Clementine. We have, we have a picture of her so we can show it to some of the companions around here. Maybe they'll point us in the right direction. You know what I think happened, B12? Global warming. I think that's what happened to your family and friends. Okay, is there nothing on this side? That's creepy. Okay, so up would be the way to go. Oh, cool. Books? Do you remember books? There are so many books here. The Turing Test Legacy, The Ethics of Artificial Intelligence. I recognize some of these. Did I have a library? I remember nothing was quite like the smell of books and the turn of a page. It was a feeling, almost like comfort. A book was like spending time with someone. I wouldn't know because I don't read, as y'all can tell who's been watching this series. They are jamming out over here. How about I shut that shit off? Oh, it's still off. <laughs> are you in a nice little place here? Pretty cool. Yeah, right, well, I'm out. Thanks for nothing.
Is somebody running? What are they doing in here, Blaine? Don't worry about trash. Neko Corporation takes care of everything. Right, let's see what you gotta say. Hey, pay attention to me. Hey, look at me. Can we not... Can you not talk to me? Alright, he has nothing for us. Already told you five times, Yosh. You can't run around like that. It's dangerous. Hey, this is the first time I've seen this kind of robot. You look so fluffy. Yeah, how about you tell me about Clementine? Oh, it's the girl displayed on this wanted screen, right? You should ask somebody else. I'm too busy with Yosh here to know anything. Alright. Yosh, how about you quit that running around? Acting like a hoodlum. Damn, is he going to jail? What the hell are y'all doing over here? Please state your identity. Cooperate or we will have to transfer you to jail and reboot you. Damn, that's a little harsh. Please leave me alone, I'm not the one you're looking for. If you're looking for Clementine, I'm sure she's hiding in the residence. Uh, what a snitch, number one. Snitches get stitches around these parts. Access to lower level is restricted due to organic life hazards. Please keep out of this area. be something over here, right? Like, to just randomly have this here that you can jump over? That is so surprising to me that they would have all that there and it's really just a big bunch of nothing. He will not talk to us. Midtown. Hey, I'm off to work. See you later. Okay, honey, be cautious of the sentinels. Sentinels? They are quick to make arrests for no good reason. Don't worry about me, babe. I'm good. You're not good. They are, uh, they're on asses out here. You might want to stay inside. Can we talk to you? Hmm. Consider this tomorrow if I replace my arm with another robotic arm, and then the next day my other arm too, and then my body, and so on until I've replaced all my parts and upgraded my software. I will be the same robot you are talking to now. I don't care. Can you just tell me about Clementine? Oh hey, what are you showing me right now? A bunch of people I don't know. My guess is that they probably live in the massive housing building further uptown. Do what you want with that. Alright. Probably further uptown. October 11th. Ooh, excuse me. At Neko Corp, we work all day long to gather the waste and send it downstairs where they recycle and re repurpose it. Speaking of downstairs, it has been a while since we had news from them. Oh wait, actually I need to show you something. Cool. 
cool picture of that one. Hey, is that an address on the back? First symbol is a street, and then there is a floor and a door number. Should be pretty easy to find. I cannot read that address. This is a picture of Clementine and Baltazar. He told us to find her. She's an outsider too. There's also a series of symbols written on the back of the pictures. Yeah, all right, so we'd have to see the. What is this? Clementine, troublemaker, outsider, rebellious. Does that mean we're close? I don't know. Sorry, little one, you can't play over here. The Neko Corp factory is no place for a little fuzzball like you. Access is restricted, but only for a little while. If you can wait a few years, we'll open right back up. We don't have a few years. Cool picture, the address is on the back. It's first, all right, you say the same thing the other buddy said. All right. Should be easy to find, they say. I'm busy, what do you want? Buzz off, okay? Wait. He said, I'm no snitch. There's way too many people to talk to. Club's clothes get lost. Oh yeah, who are you? Police? Everyone's looking for her. I didn't let her in if that's what you want to know. Well, I just want you to tell me where she's at. The merchant crook sold me a faulty battery the other day. Now he just pretends not to hear me every time I try to confront him. If it wasn't for the Sentinels on patrol, he'd end up as spare parts. Can I not show him? Whew! Excuse me, excuse me. Huh. I'm not getting very much luck right now. Been in the city below. I had a friend there, Fifi. I haven't seen him in ages. And you have nothing. Some of these dialogues I wish we didn't have to sit through. Even if this guy bums me out, he's my only customer. Try not to scare him away, please. <laughs> Y'all are so mean to each other. I used to own a bar. It was the coziest place around here. Until I took a screwdriver in the knee and it's closed now. So all these conversations are so useless. Doesn't anybody know where she is? Don't proceed further. Access to outside is fully restricted. Elevator has been disabled. Exterior is unsafe. Do not proceed further. He's not happy. Okay, we can't go that way. Well, I can't go this way either, huh? You know what, my friends? Stay away from the Sentinels. They're vicious and they got my buddy Pablo. He's in for 350 years, so be careful. 
What the hell did Pablo do? Oh, Clementine, if, if I were you, I would not want to find this girl. It's only a matter of time before she gets caught by the Sentinels. But keep asking around and you'll end up finding her. Just know that you will also find trouble. We ain't worried about no trouble. I just walked near the elevator and I got yelled at by the Sentinels. For years we have been told that the surface is uninhabitable. We just accept that as fact. But why? I don't know. How about you tell me about Clementine? What's this? Oh, what a lovely photo. I think she looks familiar, but I can't be sure. My hard drive is a little buggy these days. I'm sorry I can't help you. You should ask somebody else. Alright. That's well, alright. I do feed a night chef. Please help me. Can't you pay me with real money? I don't want anything. I just wanted you to tell me who that was. <sighs> we are not getting anywhere with information right now. Oh, wait, did I Whoops. Damn, buddy. You good? There you go. Maybe watch where you're walking. <laughs> you look like you know. Sorry, shop's closed. I'm waiting for the delivery guy, but it seems they are taking their sweet time. What's, what's that picture? Oh, I know her. She's one of those people who all, who's all obsessed with the outside. Can't tell me anything else. There's way too many ways to go. It's the trendiest shop in Midtown. But the shopkeeper's pretty grumpy. What a nice looking picture. Is that an address on the back? Yes, for alright. Okay, you have nothing for me. Alright. Fine, fine, fine. This area is way too big. Are you one of those young punks listening to loud music all day? Don't touch anything, don't make any noise, don't ask for credit. Who is that? Their clothes look terrible. Send them to me if they want to. Oh, God. What is the problem here? I feel like we're just getting nowhere. The hell with the Sentinels, long live the outsiders. <laughs> There you go, I like this area. Uh, can't talk to him. Okay, we've already been this way. We dip down in there. So then we come up here. And then what's the... That's blocked off, so you can't go in here, but can we talk? Yeah, no, 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 we've been, okay. We talk to them. So the only way to go is this way. I tried downloading an aimbot to be the best at this game, but ended up with them. Malware, malware. I'm not sure why, but everything seems odd now. Nice picture. I've seen this girl before, I think. She was looking for information about all sorts of very old machines. Weird. I've mastered every game that ever existed, but I can't figure out how this one works. Am I not seeing the whole picture here? Well, speaking of picture, 
I've seen this girl before, I think. She was looking for information. Alright, you're saying the same thing as old buddy. Hop up on this stool. I don't know, Tonin. I like pretty much everything. Nice picture. I've seen this girl before, I think. Same thing. Are all of y'all going to say the same thing? My favorite drink is oil. What's yours? <laughs> I think everybody here is going to say the same thing with this. Wait, what will it be today, little sir? Our world must seem gigantic from your little eyes. Wish I could be as tiny as you. I could explore new hidden places. Okay, last person, you're going to say the same thing. You won't even let us talk to you. Which I'm actually fine with. We're not wasting our time. We have already talked to them. This isn't it so cool right now? So chill, I think that nothing bad could happen to us. Oh yeah, I know her. I used to see her. I think she lives around here. She was always talking about leaving the city. I don't get it. This place is great. Why leave? Why would you say nothing bad could happen to us? That's a terrible thing to just throw out there. DJ Matsy tonight at the Go the Goru Two Club. Garo the Goru Garo. He's waving at a camera. It's pretty fucking suspicious. <laughs> Okay, she's probably up there. Let's get dialogue out the way. Hey, dumb face, we can see you too. That's a little immature. <laughs> like, let's grow up a little bit. Life is boring since the Sentinels put cameras in our residence. Hey, those tapes are ours. Don't you know not to steal? I can give you one, but you'll have to do something for Genma, Miko, and me. Sentinels have installed three security cameras to watch over us. We don't like that at all. Can you get them off our backs? I don't have any tapes, so I don't really know why that even got brought up. Okay, I don't think there's anything we could do down here. I think she's going to be up here somewhere. There's somebody we can talk to in that other corner. Oh, I hate that there's so many ways to go. I love how they're like, it should be fairly easy to find where she lives. It's not. What's that noise? I oiled up all my bearings last month. Okay, there's nothing here. What do you mean you forgot your character sheet? I spent the whole week preparing this session. I'm sorry, I forgot where I put it. But let's play anyways. I will go in that cave. Let's go. Okay, y'all have nothing for me either.
Okay, they are mad about these cameras. Alright, there's one for you. Second one is here. Where is the third? See a third camera. Maybe it's higher up. We'll go to this next floor. What are you exactly? I quadruple making cute sounds. I like the concept. There's an address behind there. It's just here. Thank you. I'm looking for a camera. Where is the camera? So it's probably... I do not see the third camera that they're saying is installed. Oh, there it is. How would you get that? Huh. Okay, this will for sure be the house. Ooh. I thought you were a scent. Never mind, who are you? What do you want? Wait, so Baltazar finally decided to send someone? I guess you're my new recruit. You're not very big. How did you even manage the sewers? I guess you must be pretty resourceful. I've been looking for a way to the outside ever since I left Ant Village, but the Sentinels are always watching. Now that you're here, you can help follow me. Well, let's do it, but first I gotta check out your fancy dancy uh, apartment that you got here. Buddy, were you? Oh, okay, I thought maybe you were smoking a bomb. Not, you know, not judging. Hmm, nice place. I heard you're pretty good with plants. That's creepy. I've been working on a plan to use this old subway for a while now. I even have the keys to start it. All we need is an atomic battery to power it. I know Neko Corporation has one inside their factory. I have contact who can help us infiltrate them. I don't know his name. 
He's a robot with a bomber jacket and a gold chain. Take this message to him. No. Oh. Someone small and swift like you should have no trouble sneaking inside the factory. One last thing. Don't hesitate to ask around for help. The city is full of information. To stay clear of the Sentinels. I see how to get that. I know how to get that camera. Hey, I think Simon has something for you. Well done, I didn't think you could do it. Here, take your prize, you earned it. It's a cassette tape. Oh, thanks. Oh, go ahead, get down then. Let him know, Miko. Alright, drop it like it's hot. Already translated this, right? Yeah. Oh, a guy wearing a bomber jacket and a gold chain. I don't know what you're talking about. You can check the clothing shop, maybe. Bomber jacket and a gold chain. We've seen this dude. But where? You know, work is works. Slippy, don't lose your head about it. Oh yeah, I recognize Blazer. Weird fella. Is a beef against Nico Corp. Since they fired him, which is weird because they don't usually fire people. Or is he? What's that weird feeling? I don't know. Where's your body? A little concerning. Uh, okay, I got some weird shit going on in here. That's the best. <laughs> that is so cool. All right, let me. All right, can we get up, please? Thank you, thank you. All right, we gotta go, we gotta go. We gotta find, uh, Bomber Jacket guy. Have a good nap, though. Bomber Jacket Go Chain. I know we've seen this dude. Y'all have been actually pretty helpful. We heard that. How about this? It's a blazer. We used to work together. Last time I heard from him, he was making some plan about Nico Corp. You always give me just enough info, but like not enough info. All my jacket gold chain. I hate that my memory is so bad. Russian Russell was not Clementine. Continue the search. 
I just arresting anybody over here. Uh, can't go this way. It's blocked off. Came from that way. Clubs closed, get lost. You know anything? A bribe? I don't take bribes, I value my work. What is that anyway? He is not with the BS. Is it you? Yes, there's Blazer. I'm busy, what do you want? Where did you get that? Where did the newspaper come from? <laughs> oh, you're without... My contact, let me brief you about the atomic battery. The battery is powering the Nico Corp factory right there. This whole area is restricted and heavily guarded. They check every person who enters and turns anyone away who is not a worker. Here's an idea. Go get me a worker jacket and a worker helmet while I stay here to check for a good time to enter. You have any more info? Go oh, give me a worker jacket and worker helmet so we can go in. Where do I get that shit from? Close store? Are you one of those young punks? No, you don't have anything. Oh no, you're not gonna make me listen to that savage music. <laughs> Alright, buddy, calm down. Oh, we're gonna steal. Uh oh. No, 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 you're not gonna steal that. <gasps> I got an idea. I got an idea. I'm glad I did that camera thing. <laughs> Where's the worker hat? He's not happy. And you can't turn it back on. Uh, so do you not get the hat from here? I need to find a worker jacket and a worker helmet to get inside of the recycling area. Maybe some of the shops around here have these items. Okay, yeah, so... Hmm. Wouldn't be dealing with a thief right now. Yeah, good luck with that, buddy. Where would we find a hat? Perfect, that jacket is exactly what we need. Still need a worker helmet though. Did you find one of those too? Nope, I didn't. I'll be back. Worker helmet.
blazer. Blazer, where do we find this at? Ages for Stuplachi to get back and help me restock these hats. The boss is not happy. If that guy's slacking off at the bar again, he's on, got another thing coming. Okay, so the bar would be somewhere... Shops are all this way. the bar? What am I gonna do? He's gonna pay, pay me this time. 
Oh, we paid you too. Okay, we're back to where that's the dude. Oh, here's a bar. Okay. Which one was he? It wasn't him. It wasn't him. I think it was you. Pick responsibly, little one. Not like this guy in the back room. What a pity. No, it's not you. Back room. Oh, there he is. So we need to find his hard hat. Oh, or just. Damn! Ain't that about a motherfucker? <laughs> okay, let's follow him out. <laughs> Shit. That is rough. Okay, we need to follow him into uh, into that store. Is he gonna bring this box in? Yes! We're in. Okay, so that hard hat is in the window. Okay, now we just gotta remember how to find the Nim Court or Neck Court, whatever they were called. Or Neo Court, is that what they are? Uh, anyways. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's over here by the clothes store. Here we go. We've got it, Blazer. Excellent, this helmet will do the trick. I'll get dressed now, mind turning around. He's a great little snug in the waistline, but it'll do. Okay, hop in this box and I'll sneak you across the checkpoint.
That was the worst inspection ever in the history of inspections. see what we're doing. Okay, well, let's wait for him to... There you go. Oh, No fucking way. Hey, good thing you're here. You can help me. I lost the keys to my place in this dark and huge factory. The Sentinels refused to help me. They told me if no place to go, more work here. Damn. By any chance you can help me find them, I'll be eternally grateful. Tell me if I see him, I see him, you know. Shooting's a little obsessive. Or excessive. I don't know how you get there. see it now. Let's wait a little bit. I'm gonna jump to this. There you go. Good job.
this. Okay, just stay to the side. I see what I was supposed to do, it was just too late. You're supposed to stay to the side of them, and then you wouldn't have gotten noticed. I don't know at this point, I'm just about to run past all these stupid things. This is so weird. Okay, um, let's do this. Actually, we made it into the factory. The atomic bomb or battery must be somewhere. There's the battery. Oh, this isn't really gonna help me any at all, actually.
Okay, it's almost like something. Should. Let's try this again. done figured it out people so smart. There's the battery. We got it! Quick, let's get out of here before the Sentinel show up. We've got to get this battery back to Clementine. I agree. Now that we know where Clementine lives, this will be easy to do. Okay, that's still the restricted area situation. Okay, yes. Further this way. Oh, they're there about the stolen. Yeah, let's get the fuck out of there, you know. Do you think the criminal is eyeing the collection of vintage cards? All this work for nothing. Hey, you think you can stop us from hanging in our digs? Yeah, they stopped you, buddy. You can steal our spot, but you can't steal our move. <laughs> well, there's one way to keep a positive attitude about the things going on, you know. Well, they can't stop me. We're doing 
good. It's another level, right? Oh, they're not turning. Okay, so we're not going that way. This one isn't turning either. Again. <sighs> okay, I see what we're going to have to do. We're definitely going to have to use those boxes to jump into. that they started us way over here. Once he turns, we're gonna jump into that box. There you go. I hope that's that's not the door, is it? Nope, it's not. That's not good because I don't know which way to go. Once he turns around, we'll hop in that other box. Was there like a stairway or something that I missed? Yes, okay, I see where it's at. We'll wait for him to come back and turn around. Distracted on my noise. Where's the actual door? Okay, we still made it. We're good. Yo, 
buddy, the police are like right outside your door, so. Oh, what is this? I love the lava lamp situation, that's really cool. Did that like actually do something or? Oh, this is cool. Oh my god, this is the best. That is the coolest. I'm gonna have so many screenshots, I'm gonna share on my Instagram. I wanna see how far, far out this goes. That is really cool. Okay, we gotta see if we can find them. around very strange hope nothing happened to clementine let's find her is she not in clementine's not in the okay clue board clem no sign of clementine oh what's that looks like some kind of coded message we're going to have to play detective to figure it out what happened to her look for b12 and the cat the answer lies in my stuff and there's four symbols Sign Clementine, take a look. Gained a new item. Answer lies in her stuff. You found something? I don't see anything, are you sure? No clue here. Okay, so this is nothing. Are you 1000% sure? Let's try one more time. Nope, that's just regular furniture. Alright, well. I hope you're right. Nothing on our clue board, huh? Since just can only detect harmless chemicals in a gaseous state, they can relate. Oh, recreate the calming sensation I remember. Like me, companions can't smell, so I wonder why they do this. This is also a message hidden under the container. It says, I'm with blankety blankety blank. Anything else? something? I don't see anything. Are you sure? What are you going to say? It's just furniture? There's nothing here. Nope, it's just regular furniture. Okay. Just double checking. Wait, what is that? Oh, right here. What an odd thing to have in an apartment. Is this the way the companions here see humans? kind of funny. Look, something's been left here. It says, blankety blank come to blank. Blankety blank come to blank. Oh, 
I have no idea what this is, but it glows. It's kind of mesmerizing. Sorry, I was elsewhere. I didn't even notice the message here. It reads, blankety blank 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 nightclub. Maybe cracking the coded message will help us find Clementine. For now we have, I'm with blank, come to nightclub. Okay. Found something? I don't see anything, are you sure? I guess not. Ah, it's bothering me to leave this. There's nothing here. Okay, fine, fine, fine. I'll leave it. I'll believe you and leave it. There should be something upstairs. Is what I would assume. What did I say? You found something? I don't see anything. Are you sure? Alright, no I'm not. Let's head upstairs. We already checked in here, right? It was just that there that we said was nothing. I'm sure the final clue would be up here. Yeah, right here. There's a note. The gem, this gem is a medium volume and low purity. The glow seems to have been added artificially. Maybe it acts as beacons for us to find something useful. Bingo, there's a message that says, Blank Blazer. Oh, okay. I'm with Blazer, come to nightclub. There you go. That's it. Well done, Lieutenant Cat. Now let's go find her. We don't have much time. Nice! GG's! Okay, we gotta go to nightclub. Do I have to go back out this way? This is gonna suck. Oh, okay, shoot it. There's another way out. I wonder if they'll may have to just jump out there and run. Yep. That's not a, ah, I'm sticking out of the box. Damn it. Okay, let's try this again. We need to find Is running past him gonna be the Okay, there's answer my question. This one's gonna be hard because he's not gonna turn around. Um unless That could work if we can jump across. There we go. How did I get so smart? You gotta see the movements. He's not moving at all. He is. 
We should just have to run across, right? Because isn't there... Oh, there it is. Okay, we'll wait till he turns back. I think there's a little... A little way we can go down. We'll have to be quick, though. No, we don't. Actually, get in the box. And then... Yep, right after he leaves, we can jump out. Okay, he's not going to turn around. This guy will. Ooh. Okay. Okay, let me see what we gotta go again. How many time left as a coded message? It says I'm with Blazer, come to nightclub. Okay, so we need to go to nightclub. We did it! Look at this! Okay. The real question is gonna be where is. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't do that. Where is the nightclub? Oh, we got something we can remember. The Sentinels, they were meant to protect people. Fighting crime and maintaining order. But as life became harder in the city and groups started to rise up, the Sentinels quickly became the hounds of the powerful. They were the perfect tool to keep the city under control, obedient, unquestioning, tireless. Even after the end of humans, they continued to exert their control. Always on duty, relentless. Well, thank you for that, B12. I hate the music here. Doesn't look like anything else important in here. And it's definitely not the nightclub. I work hard to clean the streets, only for others to mess it up again. Anyway, that's how the world works. Sadly. Howdy, partner. Why don't you come over here so I can get a good look at you? Oh. How would you like me to do that? Okay. 
Wonderful. Look at this little cutie. That's it! Oh. I thought something like important was gonna happen for doing that. But we get a great screenshot here. I love it. What is up here? This spot is nice. What I wouldn't give to actually feel the softness of pillows or the taste of a cold drink. This drone is useful, but I miss having my own body. I miss feeling. I even miss hurting and being hungry. I know this isn't helping, but what if we stayed just a little longer? Thanks for listening. I'm ready now. It was so sad. You know what? We can we can stay. We can stay right here for a second. That's so sad. All right, seconds up. We got we got work. Okay, well that was neat. Wait, did I feel like... Huh. I thought I heard like one of the most sounds of like there being... Something that B12 can remember. Oh no, okay. It's whenever we walk past that word. You have no business here unless you want your legs replaced by something more fancy, which you don't. So get lost. Oh, this is a surgery room. Well, excuse the fuck out of me. Somebody tell me where the nightclub is. This is where we just came from, right? Yes. Here's the nightclub. Okay, wait, let's talk to these people first. I hate this club, it's full of posers, but at least there's no sentinels here. Danger groove levels at 2%. Please find a dancing spot immediately. <laughs> I feel you. I don't blame the bouncer. Oh, excuse me. I don't think the bouncer is going to let us in. Hey guys, I think we are going to have to climb at, climb at the back again. Climb at the back. It's not for you. Go away. A bribe? I don't take bribes. I value my work. What is that anyway? Okay, well, okay, so we can get in through the back is what that other guy said. get up there we would need something we can jump on here
how can we get up there? You are looking for some company to talk to about poetry. I live behind the elevator. Bonobot. I wonder, it feels like a long shot, but I wonder if this guy There it is. I was going to say, I wonder if him telling us to jump up there was going to have something to do with this, and I was right. Hey, how'd you get up here? You want to party with us? Here, jump in and go get a drink. Ooh, Alex, you're a real one. Enjoying yourself, little one? What is that thing? Alright. Well, thanks for letting us in, Alex. Hey, customer. The access to the VIP balcony is closed. Some private biz is going on in there. It's been reserved by some blazer guy, I think. Well, did you just put his business out there for the world to, to know? Probably wasn't your place to tell anybody that. Hello again, dear customer. I had several complaints, so no, we can't disable the hollow dancers because some idiot thought it was funny to steal the lever handle. Anyway, you want to drink something? Nope. I don't. Can we take this to the DJ? This is so cute if you could take this to the DJ. Ah! Oh, come on. That is too cool. I wish you could get the icons off the screen though. Hey everybody, DJ Matsy here. Let's get the party started. The first song has been requested by our very questionable friend, Blazer. It's a very good question. There we go. That's a better shot. We're just fucking with everything right now. <laughs> I, I'm dead. Scratch that shit then, Lulu. 
<laughs> it's the best. Oh my god, I love this game. I paid extra to get into Knight's dance moves from the bouncer. He's the one programming the holograms in this spare time. Okay, look at you. There, get down in here. You like my mask? I made it myself. Your mask is kind of cool, buddy. It jams, the Sentinel scans, and it looks cool. I like it. Give it to the left, give it to the right. Beep, boop, sweep, swoop. It's called the Zigma Dance. That was kind of fucking lame. I'm not gonna lie to you. This club sucks. When I tried to go to that stupid VIP room, they kicked me out. Me, can you believe it? So I stole this lever just for kicks. Does he think that like makes him cool? If you give me a drink, I'll give you this silly lever. Don't need it, and I don't want to be caught with it. So I mean, just give it to me. How the hell do I get him? That was easy. I don't really know what to do with this lever, but okay. Oh, thanks, my friend. Here you go, as promised. Gained a new item. Okay, so... Does the lever go over here? I bet it does. He said we couldn't disable them. Do we have to do that before? I wonder if that's something we have to figure out before we can move on. I feel like there has to be something else to this before we can move on from here. to have something to do with this stuff. I 
I don't know. I'm very confused. Are you supposed to... That's weird, I'm not sure. It would have to have something to do with this, right? I bet it does. And then wait for him to cut it back on and we head up on top. I don't know, I don't think this is right either. There we go. We were onto something. This doesn't feel right. <sighs> Finally, okay. There's Blazer. very good relationship with the Sentinels. I don't understand why people complain about them so much. I don't think I would be interested in what you have to give me. I already have access to everything. Let me dance now, please. Okay, well, do your thing. How about that? She tied up? Blazer's a fraud? Yep, Blazer's a fraud. Two birds with one stone. You're not as clever as you look, little cat. Anyway, nothing personal. Business is business. Business is money. And I value money way more than friendship. Or camaraderie. Com 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 there we go. They are all yours. There we go. 
Oh, we don't have our backpack anymore. Okay, just making sure nothing was on that side. He's the smartest cat of all cats. Or she. <laughs> Jail. Uh... This game went zero to a hundred, like, really quickly. At least we don't have any desserts right now. Damn. You're going through it. Uh, but I have the feeling that we have to go through that way. No, we can climb up. another way around oh that's sad Just go. Oh, I could have done this the whole time. Okay, we need to know where that robot is. There it is. Okay, we'll wait for it to turn back. Okay, so we are supposed to go up the stairs. Where's the way to go? Oh, 
Oh, we, okay, we don't go upstairs. Let's wait for that to leave. I see now. keys out of this room. We also need to make sure we're not missing anything important because I kind of ran through here really quickly. Okay, we can't jump up there. There may be something of some kind of importance in here. Or not. Which way are we going, bud? We need B12. I mean, that's kind of an important get back. We gotta get him, Lulu! Let's get it.
Oh, okay, that, that thing moves. Oh, but the window's right there to our right. This doesn't feel like the right window to be to, to go through. Oh, maybe that was just for that. or something here. I don't know what it would be. Eee. All right, we got to jump on top of the AC unit. This is gonna suck. Um. What is gonna be the goal? Okay, there's B12. this window. Ah! It's about to start shooting. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. <laughs> There's the window to jump out. Okay, Oof. that wouldn't have me sweating bullets. Nice, we 
got to be 12 pack. I felt like I was trapped in my lab's computer system again, all alone. But you can, but you came back for me. I can't believe it. You're a good friend. B12 is kind of depressing. I'm so glad that we are still together again, but we're not safe yet. We need to find a way out of here. Can you open that door just there? Yes, B12 can. That's what he's here for. Clementine was just gonna tell me. Are we gonna break something? Oh, damn. One way, I guess. Oh my god, I'm loving this so much. This game has really picked up. Since the first two to three hours of it. Those sentinels are blocking the way again. They will spot me instantly. Maybe you can try to bait them into those cells and lock them in. Oh, this is gonna suck. that guy on the ground over there he was robbed I don't want to lose my memory I'm so scared do you have anything else to add my memories I'll lose them all forever well, that's not gonna happen This recovery center has done me the greatest good. My mind is clear now. Lucid, I am exemplary citizen now. Ooh. Sorry, I don't know how to use that. Okay. <laughs> well, sorry to fuck with you then. Okay, so I think we have to just let them spot us and have them follow us in here. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, so we have the right idea. See if Pablo changes this conversation. Oh, no, same thing. He's locked up now, buddy. You're good. All right.
See what B12 remembers. This poor fellow. It seems that the Sentinels are ruthless when it comes to defying them. That's what I feared. They have completely erased him. No more emotions, no more self-awareness, no more memories. Please, let's not get caught. Damn. Okay, so that one's already open. I don't know if running straight through there is the best idea. It's not. That's the who this one's going to suck. Raven shot that one. Are we good? We got them. Noise. <laughs> Is this Sentinel not saying anything? Well done locking up that Oh, he's not one. I thought he was. We got to take the power back. All right. There you go. Y'all are getting a little bit of pep in your step now. You feeling good too? Oh, he doesn't really want to talk to me. I already know I'm gonna have to go down here. This door, it's the only way out of this jail. I think we can open it from that control room over there. We have to find a way to get access to that room though. Let's look around. Oh, let's make it quick, so I'm ready to get out of here. Ooh, excuse me. Okay, I know my jumps aren't. What did you stop here for? This door is the only way out of this jail. I think we can open it from that control. Oh, okay, you're still saying the same thing. What do you got to say, B12? Maybe we can take this truck to the escape. Maybe we can take this truck to escape from this jail and go back to Midtown. This truck here. We're in luck. They left the keys in the door. Hop on the back of the truck. You should be able to jump over the fence to access the secure area.
Okay, that's that's the lever. But before we do that, I kind of want to make sure that nothing important is getting left. Like, what's back here? Is this just an exit door and that's it? There we go. Door open. Please, let's get out of here. The music change tells me. Yeah, I am about to say the music change tells me this isn't going to be good. Where are you going? <laughs> Wait, are you leaving us? I'm getting shot at over here. Like, are you going to let us hop on the back of the truck or what? Thank you. Alright, Clementine. I don't know how I feel about that, honestly. There's no way we'll make it with the Sentinels on our tail. I can distract them for a little while, but you have to go. The Outsider's Manifesto says we must go outside at any cost. I wrote that. This is so sad. You're one of us now. It's not that everyone has to get to the outside, but one of us has to. Go now. I'll keep you in my ram, little outsider. Oh, that's so sad. You better escape. Things just got serious. Um, okay. What's the way out of here? I'm trying to remember, remember if I remember how to get out of here. It was through, yeah, right through here. Are we going to have to go through more of those stupid zerks? That battery thing, where was that supposed to go? I remember seeing it when we first arrived here, right here. There we go. Oh my god, are we going to be able to take the train out of here? Okay, nothing right there, so... Oh my god, this is the coolest. This is so exciting! <laughs> the control! 
control room. That would be kind of dark and scary for a cat. Not this way, right? No. Uh. Oh, okay, there's somebody sweeping. Hello, how may I help you? I guess you can't, buddy. This is such a weird... Such a weird place. <laughs> Greetings, inhabitant of Walled City 99. Walled City 99. What do you got to say? I'm currently painting this area. Please be careful of the wet paint. Have a nice day. Okay. This area is so weird. Greetings, inhabitant of Wall City, Walled City 99. I, that's jumbling up. This door leading to the surface is currently locked due to, due to the confinement procedure. Please refer to an, any certified engineer inside the control room. If you have any requests, have a nice day. So we need to be inside the control room. you hello my current task is clean the window please refer to any okay same thing control room got you hello the city has been sealed for your safety please refer to Looks like we need to go to the control room, which is right over here. The control room is closed by some sort of security protocol. It says that only humans are authorized to enter. It also says I'm not considered human, and it's offensive security protocol. <laughs> Maybe if we work together, we can open this passageway. something over here. That's weird. It's not letting me work on anything. together. Well, I'm trying. But why? Uh... Oh, right here.
That's extremely dangerous. Like, that's... Alright. Lulu, let's not ever do that again. What the fuck is wrong with this cat? Lost this is a control room for the entire city. They controlled everything from here and it's empty. I remember hating them so much they had everything. Clean space, limitless power, freedom to move. Little good it did them. The plague, I remember now. Everyone was dying and they thought they were above it all. They did nothing to help us. They watched my family die. I felt helpless. I couldn't do anything to save them. Your family died from the plague? But I can still help you. We can still go outside together. I will carry the memories of humanity and the people I loved. Let's do it, B12! Well, before we do, we gotta search the area. <laughs> Y'all know me. This is way too much uh, open space here. So for this being my first playthrough, I'm definitely positive that I missed out on a lot of stuff. Side little uh, little side jobs and things like that. But I'm definitely going to replay this game and uh, go find everything that I didn't get because I'm sure there's a lot. And so that's what the Zerk are, are plagues. This is it, the main computer. According to the mainframe, no one has been here for years. The whole city is stuck in a lockdown cycle from long ago. If we disable it, we should be able to leave. We'll need to bring the rest of these systems online. These computers hold the data we need. We need to turn them on. While you do that, I'll look for passwords and encrypted keys to get into the system. These long rows of computers need to be turned on. Oh, so we'll go do that first. Okay. Please don't. It worked. Good job, my friend. I found it. I know how to open the city. Something's off here. Of course it is. This would have been way too easy. Wait, maybe there's a way around it. There, that's the workstation to open the city. But there are several layers of security preventing us from using it. Exactly. Now we need to do what we do best. Me, I'll hack the machines and you destroy some stuff. Where am I going? He won't tell me any more information. I don't know what we're doing, B12. I destroy some stuff.
currently locked due to confirmation. It's the same conversation. Please refer to us. Have a nice day. Okay, so that's not going to open that. So whatever we need to do is still in that room. If you only knew how annoyed I am that he didn't give any information other than I need to destroy stuff. taking more than I expected. Oh, that's not good. Oh no, we've got to keep going. Okay, um, so we got to find some more stuff to destroy. B12, I'm fucking scared right now. Okay, something here. Did you hack that? Okay, so we should have one more. Don't worry, I can recharge once we open up that workstation. B12, you're gonna die on me, aren't you? This should be the workstation, right? No, no, go down, go down. I think this little body is done for. It's okay, I'll be alright. Just carry me to the workstation. We can disable that alarm. Okay, I think B12 is okay. That's it. We're safe. Oh no. Listen, I have something to tell you. Oh, oh my god, he's gonna die on us. I knew the power required to disable the city's central control system would be immense. More than this drone's body could handle. Oh my god. But with the security now disabled, I can take control of the system and open the city. Overriding it could destroy my software. But I made that choice when I hooked into the first computer and the consequences it could bring. I'm sorry we won't see the outside together. I thought I needed to carry on the memories of humanity to hold on to the past. But I see a future in my companions and you. Here, let me take that off of you. That's so sad. You were my friend. The very best I could have asked for. Thank you. Tugging on the heartstrings. 
And there goes B12. We can go outside now. <laughs> oh my god, this is so cool. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to uh, close my camera here for this. So that we can see a, a better view. That was pretty awesome. The outside is opening up. Wow, this whole underground. This is so cool. This is so neat. Okay. Uh, sunlight. This is so cool. What what happens with the... Now I'm curious what happens with the robots. Are they good? Like, are they still just moving around? I guess we can go outside this door. Actually, wait. Before we leave... Is B12 still in here? Oh yeah, but okay, but it won't let us. Okay, yeah, we're leaving B12. We are leaving B12 behind. Let's get out this door. And go see if that other door is open. Okay, no, robots are still alive. See what he says? Oh, no conversation. Was this anything? Okay, no, it doesn't do anything. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
I so badly want to know what happened to the robots. Was that B12? Oh, that was so good. Ladies and gentlemen, that will do it for our walkthrough of Stray. Thank you so much for all the support through these videos. And um, I hope y'all enjoyed this game as much as I did. That was really good. It started out very slow. Uh, I was quite bored in the first, I would say, two, two hours of this. Uh, but it picked up quite a bit and man, did it, it, it got really, really good. So yeah, that was, that was really exciting. I'm actually going to skip and just see if anything pops up before I end this video. No. Okay. It goes back to the starting screen. Okay. I just want to make sure we didn't miss anything there. But once again, thank you so much for all your support. If you want to support more, you can hop over to twitch.tv slash Anthony streams uh, with two Z's. Anthony streams, two Z's on end. And um, hit a follow there. Even subscribe if, if you feel that in your heart. But uh, <laughs> that's that's where you can support support me at over on Twitch. Also, uh, like and share these videos if, if you had a good time here uh, through this playthrough with me. Uh, once again, thank you so very much. And uh, I'm Anthony streams and I'm out.